I was working part time in a five and dime. My boss was Mr. McGee. He told me several times that he didn't like my kind. He said I was a bit too leisurely. Seems that I was busy doing something close to nothing but different than the day before. That's when I saw her. Dang, I saw her. She walked in through the outdoor. Yeah, boy. She wore a raspberry beret. The kind you find in a second-hand store. Raspberry beret. And if it was warm, she wouldn't wear much more. Raspberry beret. I'm pretty sure I love her. Built like she was, she had the nerve to ask me if I planned to do her any harm. <laughs> so I pulled her up, I put her on the back of my horse, and we went riding down by old man Johnson's farm. Well, I said now overcast days, they never turned me on. But something about the clouds and her mixed. You know, she wasn't very bright, but, but I could tell when she kissed me that she knew how to get her kicks. She wore a raspberry beret, the kind you find in the second-hand store. Raspberry beret. And if it was warm, she wouldn't wear much more. Raspberry Beret, pretty sure I love her. The rain sounds so cool when it hits a barn roof and the horses wonder who you are. Thunder drowns out what the lightning sees and well, you, you feel like a movie star. Now listen up now. They say the first time ain't the greatest, but let me tell you, if I had the chance to do it all again, I wouldn't change a stroke, cause baby, I'm the most with a girl as fine as she was then, yeah. She wore a raspberry beret, the kind you find in a secondhand store, raspberry beret. And if it was warm, she wouldn't wear much more. Raspberry Beret, I'm pretty sure I love her. Yeah, my Raspberry Beret, I'm pretty daggum sure I love her. So tell me, tell me, tell me, where has my Raspberry Woman gone? Where's she go? It'll be good.